Hey, what's going on guys? It is Lasty here and welcome to a new episode of The Random Pick. First off, if you guys are looking to buy any coins, then check out the fifashop.co.uk and use that code LA5TY to get yourselves a nice 5% discount. Links are down below in the description. And if this video can hit 2,000 likes, that would be absolutely amazing. So, we go into it. First page we get is a page number 5. We've got no limits today, um, but that sometimes means that, you know, we get lower rated players. Sometimes means we get higher rated players. And the first person we get today is a Cesc Fabregas. So, a fairly high rated 86 Spanish player for Barcelona now second pull we get today is on page 29 and as we scroll along uh, you can see that again it is going to be Cesc Fabregas so we go to the next uh, the next highest rated player on the page and that is 85 rated Karim Benzema uh, so we get another player from Liga BBVA and then the third random pick we get today I'm not sure what page it's on what page is it on page 14 Page 14, and as we scroll along, it's quite clear to see that we get the Inform Isco. Um, so we've got three players from La Liga BBVA. I won't just build a, a La Liga squad, don't you worry. I will try and make it a little bit better than that. Um, but we go ahead and build our squad, and we're going to be using the 4-3-3. The fourth variant of it looks like a pretty decent formation. Um, so we'll be using that in this squad. So let's go out and buy our players then. So today... We need to go out and buy Fabregas, and I picked him up for 14,250 coins in a centre mid position. Then we go out into the market to buy our striker, and obviously in the 4-3-3, he is going to be a lone striker today, and that is Karen Benzema. 12.5k for him, uh, and then obviously we just need to go out and pick ourselves an inform Isco who has kept his price at around 90k ever since he came out, which is pretty good. Um, right, normally the earlier rated ones, they tend to rise in price, but this is where I'm going to be playing each one of the players. And the squad I'm going to use around them is this. So we've got uh, BP, uh, BPL, we've got Bundesliga, and we've got La Liga. So I've changed it up a little bit for you guys, uh, and it costs pretty much 1 million coins. You can probably get this for a mil, maybe just under if you're lucky. Uh, in goal, we've got uh, Casillas then, a great goalkeeper on ultimate team uh, left back right back we've got Debushi's in form and Alaba now I'm thinking Debushi's not going to be great and Alaba's going to be awesome I think that's how it's going to work out Pepe and Sergio Ramos as our centre backs I love Pepe love Ramos um, and I'm pretty sure that's going to be a phenomenal partnership to have, really. Uh, the left centre mid, we've gone with Bastian Schweinsteiger, this Bundesliga side of the squad. Now, he has got fantastic passing, dribbling, defending, all sorts of stuff. Uh, but then our first player for the random pick today is Cesc Fabregas. He is not the quickest, but he's got 90 passing. That is his standout stat out of everything. Uh, he's got um, three-star skills and weak foot, and he looks to be a pretty decent player. Uh, and Isco has got 90 dribbling. That's his standout stat for our second random pick player of the day. Uh, and he's got the high-low work rates. And again, with the three-star skills and weak foot. So, out wide then, we've gone with a bit of a French theme and five-star skiller theme in Ben Arthur and Ribéry. Uh, both rapid, both incredibly tight dribbling. Uh, and both are um, able to cut in and shoot because their strong foot is the opposite side. Uh, now, our third and final random pick player today is going to be Karen Benzema with 84 Four pace, 82 dribbling, and 82 shooting as well. He looks to be a pretty phenomenal player. Four-star skills and weak foot, and he's six foot two as well. So hopefully he should net some goals for us. Let's go into some of the clips that we got with the squad. Right, so this team... Uh, I'm not sure what to make of it. I've been playing really, really well on Ultimate Team lately. And this one didn't go quite as well as I thought. Uh, Ramos did pick out a couple of headed goals. You know, he, he tends to do that for me. Alaba getting up the pitch there to smash it into the back of the net. Um, but then it was it was really, this whole team was the Hatem Ben Arfa and Frank Ribery show. They scored, I've got to say, probably 70% of my goals. It was ridiculous. Look at this one right here. Just do two defenders uh, with that uh, simple McGeady spin right there. And I love doing it. I do it again uh, in, a, in a little bit. But Ben Arfa, Ribery, they scored pretty much everything. Uh, and I've got to say... Fabregas did all right. He was involved in quite a lot of the plays, and he was probably my favourite random pick play player today. Uh, Isco did also get involved quite a lot, but he was very, very weak. Um, and then Benzema, I can't say I hate him because I enjoyed him. I enjoyed using him, but he didn't score. He scored like one goal in the seven or eight games we played. I, I just. 
Normally, as a lone striker, you would expect to score all the goals, but they were all coming from my wingers. I must be playing like that recently or something, um, but Benzema seemed to be this guy, the one that plays it through um, to the one that's about to score, or the, you know, one or two passes before it goes in the back of the net. Benzema was always involved. As you can see right here, he gets an assist for Fabregas right there. Uh, a tidy little goal, a nice little one-two. Uh, but this is the goal that Benzema did get. He did take it well and get past that defender, and then slotting it in the back of the net when the keeper's coming out like that is pretty simple um, but Isco then he was sort of in the right place at the right time a little bit more than Benzema was and he did pick up a couple of goals for me right here this one pre probably being the nicest one of uh, the two as you can see there Benzema playing the ball a couple of passes just before um, we end up getting the space to shoot with Isco so that's the squad and it was a weird one you know, I, I liked it, but then again, I lost a few games, which I don't normally do. So it was a bit of a strange one to use. Uh, Cassius in goal, I've got to say, he let in a couple of howlers, which is a bit strange because normally he is fantastic on Ultimate Team. Debushi, as I thought, was pretty shit, to be honest, but Alaba was absolutely world class what a player on ultimate team he really really is uh, Ramos pushed far too far up the pitch but Pepe was an absolute rock uh, but then again Ramos was scoring some corners from headers uh, some headers from corners even so was uh, sort of made up for it in that instance but uh, Schweinsteiger a little bit slow um, but really great box to box midfielder and great free kick stats on him as well but Sesk then I mean I would say I enjoyed him the most out of the random pick players. He did get involved quite a lot, even though the stats don't really show it. I'd give him a 4-star value for money and an 8 out of 10, because he's a fun player to use on Ultimate Team. Uh, I actually, you know, I quite enjoyed him, which is it's good, because, you know, uh, there's some players that I don't enjoy. And Isco was, I don't know, he was slightly less enjoyable than Fabregas, because he was so weak. Um, but I'd give him a 3 star value for money you know it's quite a lot that 90k that you're going to pay and a 7 out of 10 because I don't think he really performed quite as well as Fabregas did and they're two very very similar players now out wide if I could I'd give both of these guys like 9.5 out of 10 they played phenomenally well in this squad I love Ribery I love Ben Arthur they're so class on this game uh, but the final random pick player is Benzema as you can see, one goal, six assists in eight games. It was almost like he was a cam. Um, and for that instance, I'll give him a three-star value for money and a six out of ten. Uh, because I didn't hate him, but he just didn't do the job as well as he really should have done for a striker. So that's the random pick, guys. If you have enjoyed, I'd really appreciate it if you drop a like on the video. That really helps me out. Uh, and I thank you for watching. And leave a comment as well if you would. And I'll catch you next time. Peace.